and many people have pointed this out because the same people who are in a sense using the return yeah. of the Taliban to to stoke a sense of uh, Islamophobia to say that oh look now you know Muslim extremism is going to rise are often the same people who themselves are guilty of various forms of extremist thought and action in this country. I have always maintained that if you look at the right wing all over the world, whether it's a Muslim right wing or a Christian right wing or Jewish wing or a Hindu right wing, their similarity is uncanny. You see, what are they trying to achieve? Taliban want to make an Islamic country, right? Yeah. These people want to make a Hindu Raj. They see that anything which is not approved by the tradition should not be accepted. That's what they say. They say that modernization brings corruption uh, and uh, indiscipline. Hmm. That's what these people say. Hmm. You see, they are also against that. They don't want uh, boys and girls uh, meeting freely and sitting in a park or a the seashore and so on. I mean, so many things have happened. Hmm. So how are they different except that they are still not that empowered as Taliban? 